engineering services and supplies business, um, sort of operating throughout the Midlands area. So we've worked with KCS for probably over 25 years now, um, so we've been sort of part of their journey really as their software um, and technology's evolved, we've sort of been very much part of that journey. Uh, from a personal perspective, I think that generally um, all of the, the people at KCS are very approachable um, and willing to sort of think outside the box. If you've got an idea of something that you wish to implement into your system, then there's always the the sort of um, enthusiasm and drive to try and make it happen for you. Um, so I think it's it's quite refreshing actually to come across people that are sort of willing to challenge the status quo, if you like, and sort of put together a system that's really bespoke and sort of customised for your own business. I think the main one is Easy AP that KCS is sort of trying to promote quite heavily. I think we were the first um, customer nationally to actually implement this um, piece of software. So that's something that. A, I'm quite proud of doing myself because I sort of led the implementation of it, but also it's brought us so many efficiencies in terms of invoice processing, invoice matching. I think from a sustainable um, perspective, obviously um, reducing the amount of paper and trying to use other sort of methods in terms of collecting information from our customers, so using like the ePod functionality for example, so being able to get electronic signatures to sort of move away from a paper-based proof of delivery is something that sustainably we all want to try and obviously achieve for the environment. And then sort of from a technology and innovation perspective, obviously the more sort of apps that we can use and the more um, pieces of technology that are sort of going to give us a competitive advantage in the marketplace because apps are something that everybody uses on phones etc. So if we can implement that into our ERP system then hopefully that will attract our customers to, to want to use us even more. Fundamentally obviously we want to grow as a business and develop our existing market segments but also sort of looking if there's new areas of the market that we can go into um, and sort of continue our legacy as a family business as well because we're now the sixth generation um, owned and operated so obviously that's quite a big part of our culture and ethos so we want to basically keep our keep our staff motivated continually train and develop our staff and utilize all this technology that's out there that fundamentally is a massive part of any business that wants to grow mm -hmm.